So, when people find out that I am a knife maker and, and uh, that's kind of what I do as my, my part-time hobby, one of the very first questions, especially when they see one of the knives, one of the very first questions they ask is how long it takes me to make one. Now, I don't know if this is common. I, I have a feeling that it is. Uh, when I even have the tendency to do that. When I go to a show and I see a really cool knife, I, I just want to know how long it took the guy to put it together. Um, so I, it's a fairly common question. And the problem is I, I don't know. I don't have a, a good estimate as to how long it takes me to make a single knife. And the reason is what I'm going to show you now. So if you look, let me switch up the camera here. If you look over here, I have a batch of 36 uh, folding blades that I've been working on. Now they started off as just uh, the basic shape cut out and I had to grind them and ream them and drill them and, and uh, do all the cleaning up and polishing and the step that I'm on right now is hand sanding so I took these all up on the belt to uh, I think it was like 600 grit and then I when I do hand sanding I step it down to 220 so these here these and these have been hand sanded these still need to be and these have only been hand sanded to 220 grit so I have to step that up and take it up to 600 grit before I send them all out for heat treat because I don't do stainless heat treating in house. So the problem is if I sat here and hand sanded all 36 knives all at once I would go absolutely bonkers because I'm just not wired to do that. So what I do is, is I, I hand sand some and I kind of get bored or get a little bit brain dead and so I come over here and over here you'll see that I'm working on a couple of folding knives too but these are W2 and what I've done is I forged them out and I've surface ground them so that they're all nice and flat and I've drilled the holes and marked out my my profile there and so these I can do all in-house I don't need to send them out for heat treat um, but I work on those for a little bit and when I get bored with that I bring myself on over to the other side of my shop over here. Now you'll see it's not particularly clean. This is a, a bar of W2 that I have forged out. Uh, it's been used my press and and I got it the dimensions that I want so what I'll do is I'm going to cut that up and make a couple of folding blades and then maybe I'll forge uh, a fixed blade into the remaining portion of it. And if we'll come back, I guess I should have dialed Dennis on one side. Over here, I have some fixed blades that I've been working on. And this one here is just some bayonet that some guy wanted me to fix for him because it was pretty cruddy and it's still pretty cruddy. Um, but over here, I have uh, a few different of my fixed blades that I'm in different stages of working on. So the problem that I run across is that I don't do things all at once. Like I don't just sit and, and make one knife from beginning to end normally. Uh, normally I, I work a little bit on one and then I go to a different stage and, and work on that. And uh, I do batches and I think people say, well, just figure out how long it takes you to do the whole batch and then divide it by 36. And that doesn't work either because I don't just sit and work on one batch the whole time. So I would have to have some sort of a system where I like set up a timer and time myself every time I was working on a knife and frankly I just haven't done that yet. So when people ask me, I don't they don't really want to just say, oh geez, I have no idea. So I usually say between eight and fifteen hours, depending on, you know, the complexity of the knife and uh and uh what I you know what sort of work I did on it, whether it was stock removal or if I forged it or if it's a folding knife. Um but the truth is I don't even know if that's a good estimate. Like it may be close. I'm I'm guessing it's fairly close. But I don't really know for sure because I've never, I've been doing this for 15 years now, I've never just gone right from the very beginning to the very end on one knife and timed myself to see how long it took. So I don't know, maybe someone has. And if you have, you know, let me know what it, what it, how long it took you. Although I have a feeling that each person is going to be vastly different. I think that there are knives that um, I can make in three weeks that someone can make in three days. So... Um, but I usually say between 8 and 15 hours. So when you ask a knife maker how long it takes him to make a knife and he kind of hems and haws a little bit, that's probably the reason why, because he works the way I do and doesn't do single knives, does things in batches and bounces all over his shop here and there, trying to keep his brain from uh, turning to mush by hand sanding for 15 hours straight.